Now look who come dragging up after I was uh, already strapping the truck down over there. Everybody see Lovey in her new dress. Come here, Lovey. What's up everybody we're back at you and we got a new video today if you look behind us back here we're about to deliver some pallet wood now today miss Britt was a little late to the arrival this morning and i've been scheming in my head so today we're going to be doing some farming and some saw milling sounds like a plan i think that's what we were named after <laughs> Hey, Britt, show them that trick we learned on TikTok. Oh, that's right. We learned a new way. Maybe some other people do it this way, but it's new to us. We just take it and we fold it up. So make you some ribbons here. Hold on. Yes, yeah, long. That's, we probably could cut off some of that thing. Probably so. Never use as long as it is. No. It's a lot to hold. I don't too tight. Mm, no, you can let off on that end, yeah. And you go around. So and you, then go. you go back through the hole that you made with all this mess I have in my hand. Well, another one that makes this particular <laughs> strap hard is a very stiff strap. It is very stiff. And then you just take it and you twist it. You got a lot of twisting because you gave yourself a lot of tail there, but <laughs> it's okay. It'll twist hey, it up. Works. It'll work. It's working. Until it gets tight. Working perfect. Keep on going till you're good and tight. That's it. Wait, no strapping job is done until you've said one thing. That ain't going nowhere. Exactly. <laughs> Bam, we're back from making the pallet deliveries. And I promised some farming and I promised some saw milling, so we'll make those things happen. First thing we gotta do, I got a little bit of ground over here. You jump on the old tractor and prep it a little bit and then uh we're gonna do some planting so follow along as we do that we'll get to the saw milling section towards the end of this video get the old ford put her to work
keep our rows perfectly straight as, as we can. So we got these uh, posts and we're going to go 43 inches apart. And then I'm going to pull this one down here. We're going to do the same on the end. Okay, and the reason we're going 43 inches, because some of you might be wondering about that random number, that is the row spacing on my Farm All Super A tractor that will be used to cultivate this garden. So we use, you have to have two strings to do this because you have to always leave one string placed, then grab another string and move it over. So here's what we do. Get our tape measure here. Hook it. Up, oh, you were over 10 inches off, Britt. Oh, awesome. Your estimate was off. Okay, you're dead on 43 now, okay? So we got a 43 inch row there. And that's just the spacing on my farm all tractor that the tires can go between the rows and the cultivators can run through there we just pull those tight and we use our push planter to run down them now Brittany's using our earthway cedar to run this row out Let's see if i can get a image of them dropping the seeds see them dropping Britt? yep keep going yeah, it's doing good. She's just using that line as a guide to keep her row straight. So we made a trip to the uh, farm supply store and we got us some beans. We got some contender beans we're gonna put out, which are basically green beans. And uh, these will get picked and snapped in the uh, pod and then we'll make green beans. We'll can green beans out of these. And then we also got some pink eye purple hull peas, which you're from, if you're from the South, you know about purple hull peas. These are Mississippi pink eye purple hull peas. And uh, we're gonna put a couple rows of each of these varieties out there they are so first we're going to put the contenders i put the big plate in which is a seed pickup plate made to uh work with that size bean and i think i'm gonna put three rows of these contenders out right now all right miss Britt here is pouring in the contenders that's good that to go a ways now we're going to line up our rows put four rows of corn this morning. I already have six rows going. Four more rows of corn. Then we're gonna start over here on the beans. All right, we're going to the pink eye purple hull peas now. Change your plate out. Now we're gonna put some of these in the ground.
that's a full day of farming and sawmilling for us. Exactly. That's going to do it for this video, guys. We're going to close this one out. What you want to add, Miss Brittany? Uh, don't forget to check out, as always, our Patreon and our merchandise. Those will all be in the description below. So look in the description below, drop box below the video, pull down the description. See those wonderful words I wrote up there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just check everything out. All the links are down there. That's going to do it. Till next time. See ya.